All right, here we go. So here is my Flawanderies deck. Finally, I'm showcasing my Flawanderies deck. I've been playing Flawanderies for a while, but like I say, I was banned on PlayStation, so you guys didn't get a chance to see me play it when it first come out, but here it is. So, of course, sometimes you draw like a brick when you play um, Flawanderies. So what I do is I just play Eaglin, like nothing happened, draw the big boss that I need, and then I just use Harpy's Feather Storm, and then I just kind of like try to stop whatever they're trying to do, because they can't activate monster effects when I play Harpy's Feather Storm, which is why I just play Eaglin. Um, and then I just kind of hope for the best, you know, hope to draw into something. So I get Pot of Duality, use Pot of Duality, Okay, I know I can play, okay, so two Pot of Prosperity, so I'm gonna just play Prosperity to try to search for Robina. Perfect, Robina's first card. And since I already pretty much have Eaglin, I can just search Robina right here. If he would have done something, he could have stopped me, but oh well, um, he didn't do anything, so Impin. Once I search Impin, I'm just gonna pop back um, the two cards that I have in my hand. I mean, in my uh, banish pile. Normally, you would only wanna grab one so you could chain block, but I mean, I don't care. So I'm gonna grab the trap right here, play Eaglin, grab another Impin, and then I'm gonna play Barrier Statue and then just attack, attack, and then attack. And then just pretty much end my turn right here. And then when I play this trap card right here, it has two effects. Most people only use the first one, but the second effect is when you play a boss monster, you can basically flip whatever they play face down. So I just wait till they normal summon something. And then I basically play my big boss monster. And then that allows me to chain in. And then I can send that to the banish pile. And then I'm just gonna chain block Impin and that card, which you don't necessarily need to, it doesn't really do anything. Um, just gonna flip that card face down and I'm gonna go for a map this time. Then I'm gonna use Token, but he quit. I was gonna use Token to actually pop that card back into my hand so I could use the trap card on their next turn. And then that way I would have been able to play the map, going to grab and Stree and then, you know, I could have did some crazy plays, but he quit, so oh well. GG's, buddy.